hello a great day once again everyone welcome back to the daily dose so welcome back my friends it's a new year so happy new year everyone and in today's video we will be talking about uh, some new cars from uh, Hot Wheels we've got Matchbox Auto World Johnny Lightning and Majorette so a lot of uh, brands here and their uh, some of their new cars so yeah these cars are available for this year already so let's check out first the cars here from Johnny Lightning so this is their Street Freaks uh, release number one for 2020 so they've got six cars here now again reminding you guys to correct me if I will make a mistake I'm not really quite uh, familiar with American cars so I'm just gonna try I try my best here so first up we've got the 1969 Chevy Chevy Camaro so yeah this is the Camaro right yeah it looks good reminds me of the uh, matchbox what was that blue something uh, it looked like it looked like this and uh, it has flames on the side but yeah I forgot what the name of that was then we've got the rumbler wagon this is the black one with flames so yeah this this is it yeah amazing car here and next 1964 Pontiac GTO so where's the Pontiac GTO here <laughs> yeah okay Pontiac GTO this one this is the Pontiac GTO right the blue one with the white stripe here the stripe goes from the hood until to the trunk of the car and again these cars are made of all metal die cast with rubber tires and next 1972 Ford Torino this is all black Ford Torino the interior I think is just plain uh, gray I think they they should have done a much better job with the interior of this car but anyway the body looks good the paint looks good and every other detail looks good as well and next up 1957 Chevy Tahoe uh, this is the demolition derby so this is it right this is a Chevy Tahoe it looks amazing as well Ooh, lots of details here and this one has chrome interiors I wonder why they make they made this one uh, with chrome interiors I don't know it doesn't suit the Chevy quite well yeah what do you think does uh, uh, chrome interior make this car a little bit uh, less or not anyways the last one we have we've got the 1950 Ford F1 so this is the projects in progress progress as they call it and here it is yeah lovely Ford F1 out of the six I actually love the Ford F1 the best and it has uh, the rust effect uh, on most part of uh, the body so it actually looks pretty amazing and look at the uh, minor detail here but you can see the other part doesn't have the headlight well this one here has the headlight so yeah project in progress that's why and this set here will be available already this January 2020 so if you you collect Johnny lightnings and if you are interested in Johnny lightnings yeah better better grab them next up we've got cars from Auto World they are made like Johnny Lightnings. I have seen only a few Auto Worlds uh, here from where I live because uh, they are hard to find here. But again, these are uh, all metal cars with rubber tires. And next, uh, no, not next. We are gonna check out the cars here. We've got the 1971 Buick GSX. So where is the Buick here? kindly help me out guys next 1968 AMC AMX then a Chevy El Camino so the orange one of course is the El Camino I'm familiar with this one 
looks good then 68 Ford Torino GT and 1970 Chevy Corvette LT1 this is a Corvette here in blue yeah lovely lovely casting great cars again American muscle cars so yeah these set this set here is called muscle cars USA and uh, yeah grab them if you can and next up we've got a uh, 2020 matchbox five pack already out so this is from Vinny's Diecast. So yeah, check out the cars here. The first one is a Chevy Camaro convertible. So lovely Camaro convertible here. Next up, this is probably my favorite in this set. Uh, we've got a Ford Fairline. This is a 1964 Ford Fairline here in white. It looks amazing. I just love this Fairline here next probably my least favorite among uh, the cars in the set we've got the 2016 fiat 500x here in blue and then my sec my second favorite in the set uh we've got a 1993 ford mustang highway patrol i just love police cars and this one looks amazing as well and the last one in the set porsche cayman so here's the back of the box I don't know why they put the Fiat 500X here but anyways a good looking 5 pack from Matchbox already out now next some monster truck from Hot Wheels so new set of uh, monster trucks right now from Hot Wheels what we see here is the Roger Dodger I'm really liking what Hot Wheels is doing with their monster trucks here right now they've added some great casting like uh, in the previous release they've got the bone shaker we got for Ro roger dodger uh, uh we got the camaro i think and all the other good stuff even the fantasy cars look good we got the spongebob the previous release so this is a new set here yeah check out the roger dodger amazing details on this roger dodger here wow look at that look at that details chrome engine 2 and here's the set so this set is called the blizzard bashers so in the set we got five cars they've we've got here the daily delivery on to your left then skeleton crew here and the bone shaker at the middle roger roger dodger and smash squatch right there to your outermost right so great set here and next up from other world again so new uh new cars here from other world check out the cars uh what is this this is a uh ford ford f ford pickup something <laughs> anyways this ford no f ford f-150 <laughs> yeah it's it's in here it's on the card so great looking uh, Ford F-150 here this is limited to one out of 8,500 so not really a hard uh, casting to find hard model to find next up uh, we got a Chevy here Chevy pickup so check this one out yeah this one looks amazing 1975 Chevy Silverado c10 fleet side wow wow amazing man love the colors here we got the red and white uh color scheme going on with this car and yeah amazing well, this is limited again to one out of 8500 next this is slightly uh a harder fire car to find compared to the last two one this is the dodge dart swinger yeah, this is a two-door coupe uh, they call this paint job light blue poly so some fun facts here on the left side of the card and next we've got a Ford Mustang GTA this is in lime gold paint job and yeah this one looks good they call it lime gold it looks like green to me 
Yeah. So a mixture of green and gold. So some facts here. The A in the GTA moniker stood for automatic transmission on a GT model. Oh, okay. And then total production run of the newly redesigned 1967 Mustang was only 472,121 units. Yeah, some good old fun facts on the card. And next up here, we've got the Plymouth Barracuda Formula S. Wow, this one looks amazing. Man, I love this. It is an all black paint job and looks really clean so they call this paint or color ebony so let's read the fun facts formula s option package was introduced in 1965 upgrades included the commando v8 engine wow this is a v8 engine powered car larger wheels and tires formula s emblems Upgraded suspension and tachometer. This is the first Auto World. This is the first time Auto World has released a 1965 Plymouth Barracuda with the Formula S option. Whoa! So if you want to collect the first release out there, yeah, check this one out. This is the Plymouth Barracuda Formula S, limited to one out of 5,500 cars. And next up. We've got a 1966 Oldsmobile F85. They call this paint job Sierra Mist. Limited also to one out of five, uh, 5,500. And yeah, some more facts here on the side of the card. Next. Wait, that's the same car. That's the same pickup. Oh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Different artwork. Oh, different, different art on the card. Same blue color. Oh no, this is of course in red. <laughs> so they call this magnetic gun metal. Oh, magnetic gun metal. The car, the uh, car on the card is gun metal, but the actual car here is in red what's up with that by the way this is new a new casting and also limited to one out of eight thousand five hundred uh, cars and next up here some more cars from Auto World. so first up they've got this very beautiful 1965 Chevy Suburban here wow man I just love old pickups vintage pickups I mean they look amazing. They look more beautiful than the uh, more moder more modern pickups, in my opinion. And this one has opening features, I bet. And next, this is the Jeep Wrangler. Uh, this is part of their Ultra Raw series. So this is like their Zamac version of Hot Wheels, by the way. And yeah, this one has amazing details. So uses the BF Goodrich tires. Details here look amazing. And we've got some new cars right now from Majorette also. So some 2020 Majorette cars here. This is a recolor of their Mercedes-Benz AMG GTR. Again, looks good. Everything looks good for Majorette here except, well, this is just my opinion, of course. We vary from each other, but yeah, except for the tires and rims. And this one has opening features, by the way, and side mirrors too. And next here, we've got another one from Majorette. This is their uh, Corvette here. And yeah, not really liking the Majorette logo on the tires for this Corvette, but everything else looks good. So lots of decals for this car and then we've also got the Britling Bentley. This is also again from Majorette. Once again opening doors for this set and this one actually has the best looking rims among the three Majorettes uh, we've introduced uh, in this video. 
So again, all these Kashmir Majorettes have uh, plastic inserts on the tail lights and the headlights. And also we've got here a Renault Turbo. Wait, wait, what's up? I'll just put the uh, <laughs> name of the car here on the screen right now. I actually forgot the exact name of this car. Again, not really well versed in American and European cars. Sorry about that. I just enjoy uh, looking at cars and collecting die cast cars, but I don't really memorize their names. So, yeah, great looking car. I, man, the. Uh, this intake here reminded reminds me of the car uh, used by Jay Leno in one of his show. It was a Kia, a Kia or Ford, something. Yeah, but the intake looks the same. I'll just put it right now on the screen, the picture of that car. Yeah, so great looking car here from Majorette, and from Hot Wheels here we have Kit or K I T T. This was part of their uh, Hot Wheels ID series, so some more close uh, pics of Kit here. So no details though on the headlight for Kit for this car and taillight too. Some details on the plate holder and at the back part of the car. You can see the Hot Wheels logo and the ID logo right there. And of course, like all Hot Wheels ID series cars, the tires have tampos which I really really like so yeah that's all the cars in this uh, video so yeah pictures from the uh, this video uh, comes from Vinny's diecast we've got SKDC murder mitten and then Johnny lightning diecast and also auto world diecast and yeah if you like this video don't forget to uh, leave a leave a comment down below your favorite cars in this video and smash the like button and subscribe if you haven't yet and stay tuned for more bye bye peace out and enjoy the rest of the day bye bye guys see you soon